This is a rag doll made of real person. The girl was taken to a room and displayed like a rag doll. When the woman leaves, the girl finds a hairpan for her own safety and hides it. Soon, a butcher walked in. Despite his size, he was very fond of rag dolls. The girl didn't dare to make a sound. She could only observe the butcher silently. The girl was surprised by the butcher's strange behavior, which completely exposed her. She was grabbed by the butcher and thrown to the ground. Then she was picked up by the butcher. Due to the huge difference in strength, the girl was unable to fight back. When the butcher wasn't looking, she stabbed him with the hairpin she had hidden earlier. Why is the girl trapped here? It all started 15 years ago. The girl's name was Mary and her sister's name was Luna. One day, their mother took them back to the countryside. They met a caravan on the road. The driver greeted them. Mary and her mother responded warmly. But Luna gave them a friendly gesture. By the time they arrived, it was already dark. The place hadn't been lived in for a long time, so they cleaned the house first. The mother tried to call her boyfriend, but there was no signal. What they didn't expect was the caravan following them. A tall butcher knocked the woman to the ground. Her two daughters arrived and ran away as soon as they saw the butcher. Unfortunately, they were soon caught. At that moment, a woman got out of the car. She rejoins the butcher and makes a friendly gesture to Luna. Mary and Luna are taken to the basement, where they are subjected to an agonizing ordeal. The butcher knocks Luna out and drags her into the room. The situation is critical and Mary rushes out to look for help, but she was blocked by women. When Mary doesn't know what to do, her mother rushes out and fights with her. The woman fell to the ground under the force of her mother's love. They returned to the basement and eventually rescued her sister Luna. After the incident, Mary became a writer. She wrote a horror novel about the experience, and it was a big hit with her readers. One night, they were having a party. Mary received a phone call from Luna, and she sounded panicked. Worried about her sister's condition, Mary returned home the next day. And the nightmare began again for both of them, because the butcher and woman from 15 years ago came back to the house. This time without her mother's protection, Mary was quickly captured. The woman puts makeup on her and puts her in a room full of red dolls. The two captive girls run wild through the woods. They ran from night to day. When they saw the police car, they cried out for help. Luckily, the police found them in time. After realizing the girl's situation, Tom went to the car to call for help. The policewoman stayed at the same place to comfort the girl, but neither of them noticed the caravan coming after them. Just as the police were about to take the girl away, the woman came out. She shot and killed the policeman. The girls who escaped were recaptured and brought back to the house. Mary was once again under the control of the butcher. At that moment, a nearby doll alarm clock disturbed him. Taking advantage of this, Mary escapes to another room. She and her sister fought with the woman. At that critical moment, the butcher arrived, but he was killed by the police who arrived. The woman tried to resist, but she was also shot by the police. Mary saw his true color. The woman was a man in disguise. After many tortures, the two girls are saved by the police. This is the end of the story. The movie is called Ghostland. If you like this video, you can subscribe to me. Thanks for watching. See you next time.